Man, it's a really good question. It says confidence versus arrogance. And I'm assuming you didn't write anything before that. So that's, that is the question. Confidence versus arrogance. Confidence versus arrogance, the answer is intent. I'm extremely confident. But the last thing, the, the, the last thing I don't want to do is that I want to do is come across as arrogant. And I think that has to do with being um, self-aware. Here's here's an interesting direction. I'll take this real quick because I've I've really enjoyed having this conversation over the last couple of days with a few different people. Um, having a videographer or just documenting uh, a lot of your life on social media is the ultimate form of self-awareness. We talk about self-awareness being this huge buzzword, but nobody really knows what it means as far as like how to actually develop more self-awareness. They just say like, hey, hang around some people that'll tell you the truth about yourself, which they're not going to do. It's still gonna be completely skewed. But when you talk about doing stuff for the soul, like, I will notice facial expressions in the vlog. Like TJ will be on this side of the room. I'm on this side of the room having a conversation with Ever. And I'm like, why do I look like I'm about to rip his head off? Like I look pissed off right you now. And you're pretty big. I'm like, why like, Why do I look so angry? It like make, just makes me aware of these things. The ultimate form of self-awareness is documenting your life on social media. Specifically having a videographer uh, that's capturing content um, whether you know it or not, and, not, and I don't mean that in a weird way like hiding in the bushes, I just mean that you could be in a conversation with someone and you look over and you're like, oh, that was being recorded. Um, it will tell you, it will speak volumes. It will speak volumes to your character, to your integrity, to the way um, that other people are receiving you and perceiving you. It's, it's huge. Like, so when I first started this, you know, last year, um, I would watch these videos, you know, as we put out the daily vlog at that time, I put out these videos and I'd see myself and, and it would just be me like on the other side of the room talking to someone and I'd look at myself and I think, why do I look so angry? Like, why do I look so angry right there? Like, I remember that, you know, being a really pleasant conversation, like there was nothing, you know, confrontational going on, but I look like I'm about to rip that guy's head off. Like, why do I look so angry? And so it gave me that little bit of um, insight into the fact that, huh, I should probably smile more. And when I'm listening to someone talk, I should probably have some sort of a smile and not just look like I'm gonna, you know, kill somebody at any, at any moment. Uh, little things like that, like watching yourself on video and watching yourself interact with other people on video, watching their reactions as you're talking, um, has literally, strengthened my self-awareness at an exponentially greater level than any other thing that I can possibly imagine.